your girl team Stacy, and I'm back with another YouTube video and if you are new to my channel hello but if you're a returning subscriber what's up my girl let me tell you something this is my top secret for girls that don't know how to do shadow but they need that color let's go ahead and get into it also before we get into the video this is also for my dewy girl so this is very hydrating very dewy very I drink water period so if you are ready to see the tea on this look baby girl give me your hand Put her right here and let's get into the video. Mwah. Okay, my loves. So I did go ahead and complete my eyebrows off camera, but if you need help doing your brows, I will link down below my full tutorial. But we're gonna go ahead and jump into skincare. So I moisturized my face and now we're gonna prime with the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer, which I absolutely love. After we prime, I'm gonna go ahead and take the new Juvia's Place Radiance Booster to give me that glow that I'm going for. If you want a full review on this product, I will also tag that video because I'm gonna talk about it and I'm gonna tell you what I like and what I don't. But this is the part of the video where I realized I think I grabbed the wrong shade. This was looking crazy, but you know what? It's fine because I know how to fix it and that's exactly what we did. So we're gonna go ahead and just work this into the skin to get me to the right shade that I need to be. And now we are going to blend her out. This is a pro tip for blending out your foundation. If you're having a problem with it not looking like skin and giving you that skin-like finish, make sure you're tapping and pushing the product into the skin. This is how it's gonna melt and just look so seamless. So definitely apply that technique the next time you apply your foundation. Next up, we're gonna go ahead and conceal. So for concealer, I'm using the Hourglass Concealer, which I absolutely love. Now this is a high-end product, so if you're looking for something more affordable, you can go ahead and try out the e.l.f. Camel Concealer, especially the hydrating formula. I absolutely love that product as well, but I'm just onto this one for now. After we concealed, I'm gonna go ahead and do some bronzing. Now this was giving me so much trouble, I could not get this open for the life of me. So I had to swap it out for a different shade and I'm gonna be using shade Honey. So now we're just gonna tap this into the skin to just give me some color, some warmth, just a little bit of, you know what I mean? And blend that out. Now for some more color, we're gonna take the Liquid Blush from Juvia's Place and I'm just gonna blend this out. This is in shade Pink Lady, which I absolutely love. For this look, I definitely wanted to emphasize the pink. Next up, we're gonna go ahead and blend out our concealer. So the reason why we blended out our concealer after we blended out our blush and our bronzer is because we wanted it to sit to build some extra coverage. So I wanna make sure that I'm blending out my under eyes absolutely last. We wanna make sure it's last so it can get as much coverage as it possibly can. And I'm blending out the edges first. Now don't mind me, y'all, I was turning up to my playlist because my playlist was real lit. But yeah, we're blending out the edges and after we blend out the edges, then we're gonna go directly under the eye and blend that out as well. So for setting, I'm gonna be using my one size setting powder in shade translucent, and we're just gonna pat this down. So even though we're looking for that hydrating, dewy look, you still wanna set to lock in your makeup. This is gonna help with the longevity of your makeup, making sure it lasts all day long, okay? You don't wanna hug nobody and your face is printed on their shirt. You don't wanna go two hours and now your face is melting. So this is how you're gonna make sure your face is locked in. Next up, we're gonna go ahead and set my blush. Now, because we used a liquid blush, I'm gonna go ahead and take a powder blush and put that right over everything, making sure everything is nice, set, and locked. So remember this, whenever you have a liquid, you need to set it with the powder. That is the rule of thumb. Now we're just lining my lips with the Ruby Kiss Dark Brown Liner. Go ahead and grab my Juvia's Place Afro Galactic Eyeshadow Palette, and we're gonna take this shade right here, a beautiful hot pink shade, and we're just gonna pop that into the inner corner. So, because I don't like my eyelids looking empty, I'm just gonna take a soft brown and blend that onto the lids. But this is the easiest look. You can swap this out for whatever color you want to swap it out for greens, browns, blues, it doesn't matter. I did go ahead and pop some lashes on to give my lashes a fuller look and some bottom mascara. But this is the easiest eye look I have ever done. So definitely try this out if you're struggling with your eyeshadow looks
Next up, I'm going to go ahead and take my Volumizing Gloss Stick from Juvia's Place. And this is a pink shade. I'm not sure the name, but I will go ahead and comment it down below in the description box. So you guys can check all the products out that I'm using. But yeah, we're just going to dust the face off and set her down. And this is what the girls are getting, period. All right, my love, so that's the end of today's video. In today's video, I did wanna go ahead and show you guys this super dewy, hydrating look. But that's not the focal point of this look. It, it, it eats, if you wanna learn this base, now you know how to do it. But let me tell you something. This is for the girls that don't know how to do eyeshadow. So now you know, all you need is to put the color you want in that crease. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, it was so fun to make. It, it was super easy and I hope it was easy for you to follow. I love you guys so freaking much. Like you guys mean the world to me. I always read your comments. I try to respond to everybody. You guys are just that girl. Like you're that girl, I love you. If you made it this far in today's video, go ahead and comment down below this secret emoji right here. That's how I know your game. We locked in and you know, you just watch my videos all the way through if you haven't already go ahead and subscribe to my channel give this video a big thumbs up that's how i know you guys love this type of content and i can keep giving it to the girls okay and yeah i love you guys i hate this part of the video but i'm gonna see you in the next one i love you Mwah. bye